As an example of the revolution that's happened in, in hardware, um, you know, five or ten years ago, if you had uh, even the equivalent of a Kickstarter success, now Kickstarter didn't even exist, so you couldn't have had, but let's say you had managed to get 500000 or a million dollars in sales on some device that you had created, you would have then said, okay, now I need to make a thousand of these, or five thousand, or ten thousand, or you may have said, I need some re-engineering, and um, basically you ended up in a cul-de-sac. There was no way out. There was no way to do what it is that you needed to do. That has changed, and it's just changed in the last four or five years. And as an example, um, I'm sitting in a conference room at a, a Flextronics uh, facility, an, an, an innovation center. Um, and what Flex has done, Flex is the second largest contract manufacturer on the planet. They've created on-ramps for small companies to be able to launch inside of the Flex ecosystem. This is unheard of. Five years ago, you couldn't get anybody in China to return your call. Now you've got somebody like Flex who actually, their big part of their supply chain is there, as well as a bunch of manufacturing is there, and you can tap into their uh, engineers. They have thousands of engineers. They, you can tap into their manufacturing line. They actually have dedicated startup manufacturing lines. They have a dedicated staff of engineers to work with startups and in this facility they've had over just in the last year they've had over a thousand startups come through. There's a startup downstairs that's already doing 30 million dollars in sales. Again five years ago this wasn't possible. So again we're, we're, we're now working inside of an ecosystem that has solved most of the pain points for helping somebody go as Flex likes to call it from sketch to scale. We've never lived in an era where you could tap into one of the largest corporations in the space and will help you go from a sketch idea all the way, not just to scale as far as making it, but actually into the market, into reverse logistics, into solving problems that your customers are having. Um, again, we are living in a truly amazing time if you want to do a hardware startup.